Your Weather Afternoon Express here on S3 and joining us as a superstar. You'll get to find out why and how she is the star she is. A uh, songstress who hails all the way from Italy. Please, ladies and gents, everybody, a warm welcome to Francesca. <laughs> Francesca, it's so good to have you here. Thank you for having me. I mean, first of all, you look like you've just stepped out of the cover of a summertime magazine out in Italy. You seemingly <laughs> are carrying that Italian sort of, you know, uh, holiday living uh, expression or lifestyle with you everywhere you go. Mm, I think, well, yeah, well, I, I am Italian 100%, so I think I will always, like, carry on my culture and, like, the style that, yeah, and, and that it, we have in... in in the culture, so yeah. It, it comes across so beautifully in so many ways, in your Thank music, you. in your style. Let's start there. Thank you. How did you define your sound? What is oh. this Francesca sound that makes you just so golden? I think um, it's really difficult to describe all the time your genre and your sound, but I think the fact that I've been in South Africa for 10 years, at it kind of makes it as like a melting of like Italian, South Italian culture and South African culture together. So it's really a mix of a lot of flavors. Let's say that there is a little bit of soul, neo soul. Yeah. Yeah. There is a little bit of jazz and, uh, and there is a little bit of like South African kind of rhythm uh, on the core that is always with me. I think rhythm is something similar between South Africa and South Italy, because we are people that love to dance and we love, to, love move. to move. And we have the groove inside, so yeah. yeah. I think for me, what stands out about your sound is the soul. You are just so soulful and it comes so effortlessly to you. Uh, what influenced your decision to get into music? Um, as actually, I didn't really decide to be a musician. It just, I think it was just natural. From when I was little, I was always towards um, expressing myself in some ways and could be like dancing. drawing, dancing and singing, I think. And then I just discovered that it was really gave me a lot of joy and then I was trying to express myself when I, I wasn't feeling good or I needed to kind of overcome some problems. I think music helped me. Yeah, it's a healing process for me. Yeah, so I will say that. And you've been so committed to your music. Uh, I mean, a career over or spending so many years, right? So many highlights along the way, some interesting times, uh, some, you know, so some inspiring times for you as well, I can imagine. What's been the most stand out of all of your years in music? Oh, well, um, I think like mm, writing and like writing and recording the two of my albums of my career, I, I actually made it here in South Africa, so I recorded it here. And the first one was called Zingara, which is the Zingara. name. Mm -hmm, which is the name of my band, which it means gypsy in Italian, oh. which I like, I feel myself as a gypsy person. I can see why you might think of yourself as being that. Yeah, it's even from my roots, I guess. And I'm, yeah. a, I'm a mix, I'm a mix, I have mixed culture in my blood, so I will say that I am a gypsy. Yeah. Um, and then the second one was called Ikigai, which was like just pre-COVID, and um, it was amazing. I was so happy to release this album, and then just COVID happened. like hit, happened, and then it was quite hectic. But it didn't stop you. It didn't stop me, and I'm really happy. So I will say the highlights was like releasing my music and doing this as as a living and doing this as my love and my passion. Yeah. It's already an highlight, I, I, will, I will say, yeah. I mean, uh, let's just go light with it now. If yeah. there's one thing COVID taught you, uh, that period and that whole experience of releasing music or making music and then putting it out during such uncertain times, what did you learn from that? I learned that it's really beautiful and like really special to be at home in a silent space and I think like society today is really bombarding us with a lot of information and I feel that COVID bring me like a little bit more on the floor and understand better what is my goal in life and what I want. I think mm -hmm. there was a lot of thinking about that, about what is the purpose in life. 
and you, we had a lot to think. And we silenced the noise, right? Yeah, totally. But silence is good too. Silence we is need good. silent. Silence is good. You yeah. even said the same thing when we had load shedding earlier on and the generators went quiet for a bit. You were like, oh, the yeah. silence. But you're not going silent because we want music no. from you. So let's talk yeah. about what we can expect from you moving into uh, 2023. Yeah, I'm not silent at all. Actually, they, they, describe me, they describe me as a loud person. I'm not loud all the time. I will say that I have this kind of personality that looks quite like energetic. It's dynamic. But, uh, yeah, it's quite dynamic, but I'm really, I'm really chill too. Uh, but um, I'm recording a new album, so I'm recording a new album with this band that is South African, mm. and uh, I'm hoping to release new music at the end of this year and then to kind of be able to go more around and do more festival, which is like more platform for me and my music and yes. this neo soul music and just like do as much as I can live shows and entertain people and let them feel good. And share the beauty that is Francesca with the rest <laughs> of us. And I know you're going to be learning closer, which is really awesome. Yeah, uh, I'm yeah. going to quiz you a little bit later on. But Francesca, yeah, you're ready. I know I'm you're ready. born ready. That's my queen right there. A bit later on, she's going to be performing for us some of her music that's been put together during such uncertain times. But the beauty of it is just unimaginable. And then we're going to be taking it back to some Italian cuisine as well in the kitchen. Uh, so, Palisa, what's happening over there?